What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back. And guys, today we are going over the market as for usual. Before we do get into the video, make sure to smash that like button, drop the sub. It'd be greatly appreciated. Let's try to hit 50 likes on the video. Uh, let's try to hit that sub goal, man. We're at 14. We're almost at 14K. No, I'm just kidding. We're, we're, we're going the way to 14K. We're just at 13K not too long ago. Uh, more subs, more likes in the video will be appreciated. We, if we have more subs, more likes consistently, we will do giveaways literally every single day, every other day, whatever you guys want. But uh, yeah, guys, today we are going to go over. Oh, I forgot my Lamarcus all just sold for 100K. I should have put him up for more, but um, let's actually check his value because I heard Lamarcus Aldridge, the one I pulled, is going for way more. Wow, I could have got an extra like 50K. Yeah. Wow, okay. That's an L on me. Um, we're gonna go over the market as for usual. My hair is out of whack. I'm probably gonna get a haircut today. I'm not sure, but uh, Lamarcus Aldridge, 189,000 MC. Um, so today, lads, we are gonna go over the market. Um, right now, guys, the market is up so much. There's no new content today. Um, there's no new content at all. I think the content lately has been absolutely garbage. Like this set right here, let's be real. This set right here is absolutely terrible. I think the content has been really bad, creating the market to inflate at a crazy, crazy, crazy rate. Um, so right now, what you guys should be doing is most definitely getting on the auction and literally just selling your whole team. I say this way too much. I pretty much make every single video on this literally buying and or selling your cards. And guys, the market is at its all-time peak. It is just dead. The market's dead. There's not a lot of snipes going around. It's literally dead. It's time to sell. The only player, players I wouldn't sell is probably Michael Jordan Opal because Michael Jordan Opal has a very high chance of going up before Super Packs come out. So I give Michael Jordan Opal another, I say, five days to sell before the Super Packs come out on Tuesday. I would sell your MJs on Sunday and or Monday because uh, then the packs will be out for around or will be gone for around two to three days. And then that is the best time you could sell your MJs. That's what I think. That's what I feel like the best option is. And uh, you guys should definitely listen to me on this one. I'm almost positive about that. Um, same with Giannis, same with Lonzo. I said the prices do rise until Super Pack. So right now, if you can get a Giannis for around 130, man, I think his price goes right up to 150. Unless there is a market crash this week, that is the only problem. But the market never crashes Opals. So Giannis might be a little risky, not gonna lie. But Opals, they never crash Opals, dude. The Opals are just too inflated. They're not gonna be in packs on Friday. They're gonna release Super Packs Tuesday, creating a giant market crash either Friday, but not for Opals. If they do drop fire on Friday, it's gonna be the pink diamonds that crash. So probably your Simmons, probably your Przingis. It's a good time to sell both of them. They were at 100K, 110K yesterday. Now they're up to like 130, 140. It's not a bad time to sell your cards, man. It really isn't. Look at Melo. He was at like 180 something. He's over 200,000 MT. Guys, it's time to sell your cards. Trust me when I say the same with Fred Van, bro. He was out for one day and he's literally going to be a buyout not too soon, bro. He's going to be in Super Packs. Um, he's probably going to be the most guaranteed Opal in Super Packs. So probably another good reason to sell your cards right now it's literally the market's just so inflated like i can't believe how inflated it is but um let's go over a little bit of snipe filters market super inflated dude he do circle is so cheap it kind of gets me pissed off because dude how the hell i could probably buy these bitch man i'm gonna buy these two and i'm gonna sell them probably for 2000 because 1200 i could pretty much quick sell them for a little bit more so i just bought those bitch max this amethyst filter is absolutely amazing so we got them for 1250 we're gonna sell them for 18 after reduction we're gonna make around i would say 400 mt per which is 800 which is pretty amazing to me man these this shit's gonna sell quick um the amethyst filter is amazing bro i'm telling you man when people first get on this game and they see 90 overalls for that cheap they're gonna buy them right away um so those are clearly bought out already i just bought those um amethyst filter is goaded especially if you guys know what you're doing mpj is one that's just amazing um you could literally you just want to stay away from nba 21 and uh he do circle obviously because he's just spammed up here for 1500 obviously nba 20 nba 21 you want to stay away from unless it's like Giannis and or lebron then you should buy it um but guys i'm telling you right now it's a great time to invest or go on to the amethyst filter probably one of my favorite filters in the game we also got the diamond filter guys my favorite mt making methods 
I would, every video I make that says MT making method, it's literally simply just buying and selling. It's the easiest way to make MT. It causes no effort. You just got to slightly know what you're doing, but diamond filter is still one of my all time favorites as well. I don't this is definitely my favorite by far because it's quick, easy profit, but this one's not bad either. Um, we also, another way to make MT, man, if you guys didn't know, I don't know why my season agenda won't show. I, I don't understand what's going on. It's probably because I haven't played a single game because I am in 2K jail right now, but um, I, I don't know, man. Right now, dude, if they say, like, let's say, for instance, uh, I don't know, Fred Van Fleet went off, right? They drop an NBA 21 Fred Van Fleet, bro. His Fred Van Fleet card will go up to the moon, so... Whatever they drop in the moment section of challenges, man, you want to go over to it and you want to buy that card as soon as possible. Um, so like at 3 a.m., they usually refresh the moments challenges. If you're on at 3 a.m. Eastern time or 12 p.m. Uh, or 12 a.m. Pacific, you could easily make millions of MT just by sniping off those moments cards. Um, literally hundreds of thousands of MT. One time, I forgot what card it was. I think it was on the Warriors. Maybe it was past Shao moments or something like that. I don't remember, but it was someone of the Warriors, something like that. But I was on at 3 a.m. I literally stepped out four cars. I ended up selling for 30k. I got them for around one to two k. Made so much MT. Made over a hundred thousand MT in one minute. So that's probably your best way to make MT. 3 a.m. in the morning. Keep your eyes on the NBA. Keep your eyes on anything, and you can make easy, easy MT off that. Um, I'm gonna go over one more thing, man. I've been talking about this a little bit, and it's Nike diamond shoes bro you want to look for the kdpes or anything with three point shot perimeter defense steel and honestly those are probably going to make you a lots of mt these are the shoes you don't want to look for uh those these three these are the three that you just don't want to look for even the kobe's go for a decent amount so pretty much all the shoes right here you don't want to look at kd13 hypes another one that's not good you just really want to look for the kdpes bro that's going to make you the most money it has three point shot has defense that's the money shoe it literally gives your player a huge boost but uh other than that let's look at one more thing and it's gonna be coaches i want to just check the diamond coaches look at this man diamond coaches are still going for stupid amount and i just want to go over that too as well and um really that's all we got for the video i hope you guys did enjoy one second let's see yeah that's it hope you guys did enjoy man stay tuned for more content have a good one peace